Hi Aries. So I know people are going to think that you guys are getting two reads today, but no, your video would not upload. So I had to like re-upload it today. And then you guys are getting your, like um, this is your read for this cycle around. So anywho, and then for anyone that's been reaching out for a personal reading, I just haven't been doing them because I was exhausted. I'm like finally getting my energy back. I went for a hike to like a beautiful waterfall. Anyone who follows like the other, I'm not like a big social media type of person. I like to just keep to myself anyone who knows me personally. I don't like anyone in my business. I'm like, I'm an extrovert introvert but I'm really introvert but I'm also like a like I when I'm around people I talk but I'm not like I'm a social butterfly but I'm like an introvert social butterfly fly if that makes sense anywho let's see what messages are coming through for you guys at this time Spirit of love and light, truth and clarity. What messages do you have for my Aries today? What messages do you have for Aries? Spirit of love and light, truth and clarity. What messages do you have for Aries at this time? Oh my God, well, I mean, that waterfall, uh, it's just, it did me justice. It really was just the one of the best things ever. So, okay, let's see what messages are coming through. You know, let's see. What is up, Aries? What is up? What's and it's like most of your cards are in the reverse. You guys have the tower as your overall energy. So it's like something drastic has happened and it's like it was really disappointing to you guys too really upsetting as well like something came to an end and it was just like really upsetting for you guys devastating it's really like what I'm getting here, you feel like someone just did not learn their lesson and you feel like you had to let something go. And this is like, it was really hard for you to let someone go here because it was a lot of love that you have for someone here. And the thing is, is that it looks like you view this person as like, a true love, a spiritual connection, like this was something deep here. But the thing is, is that it's like, it was meant for, because I'm getting this, like it was meant for someone to like reject your love. It's because it's almost like, It was meant for someone to reject your love or to disappoint you here in order to get you unstuck out of a situation. Because you needed to get out of this. Because it wasn't healthy for you. And that's what you needed to see.
it's like, what's so, like, is this, because, um, it's like, this is what's disturbing to me. Because someone is, like, looking at you, and it's like, every time they see you, like, trying to balance things out in your life, they come and, like, disturb your peace. It's like, they want to keep you off balance here. I, like, because literally what I'm getting is, like, they're mentally messed up. This person will never stick around. Like this has been destroyed. I'm not sure exactly what has happened, but this person has definitely been like hot and cold on you. It's like one minute they're this way, they're giving you all this love and affection. And that's, next minute it's like they're ice cold on you. But it's like they're they they can have like a really hot temper. That's the thing. Because I'm seeing it's like the next time because it's like this person comes and they're like you know, they're coming like they're apologizing because this is not the first time this person has done this. And you're like, no, no, because I don't know what this person did. And it's like, you refuse to learn the lesson. And so, like, it's almost like the universe, like, had to like show you like things were pushed a little too far this time because it's like this is a little too crazy here because this person is a off the chain because you're like no like because they're coming they're offering an apology they're offering their love again and you're like no i'm over this because you're getting unstuck from this situation because this, like, this is over. But the way that it, like, it went about being destroyed, it was really bad. And it's like this person doesn't, it's like they want to see you off balance. They don't, it's like... They don't want to see you at peace. It's like they come in to destroy your peace. And it's like you're just tired of it at this point. Somebody is ready to explode. Wait a second. Oh, 
okay. Wait a second, Aries, because we being, let's see what's going on. Okay, because we're being taken towards something else here. Oh. Okay, but wait a second. I'm saying you guys are in process of cleansing your energy. Now, okay, I need to clarify something here. Because there is a lot going on. Someone is about to reveal something to you because someone is being drawn towards you. Yeah, someone is about to reveal some truth to you. They, they've been holding back, communicating some truth to you about how they feel. Someone, okay. Someone's about to reveal some truth to you. Some woman here. Take it as it resonates, whether you're a man or a woman. There's some woman here, but they do not have good intentions because they have proof of something here. And what they're revealing to you is to uh, try to keep you and someone apart here because they know that someone wants to get with you here. And so they're wanting to reveal some sort of information to you so that you won't want to be with someone. And what it looks like this information is, is that they hooked up with this person here. The thing is, is like your person, they realize like after they hooked up with that person, they realize how toxic that person was and they really regret hooking up with that person. So it looks like, like when they hooked up with that person, they did it like in this really immature energy, like they did it to kind of like retaliate. I'm not, it's like, I don't know if they were wanting to retaliate against you because that's why I'm trying like picking up here. The thing is, is like they're feeling like they're dr being drawn towards you. But there's a lot going on here. It's like this person has a lot going on in their life. And it's like they're wanting to chase after you, but there's some a lot that you don't know. But you have, 
it's like things are about to explode. There's a lot of information that's about to come to the surface regarding someone here from the past that you had a lot of love for. And it's like, I'm getting, this was either someone you saw marriage with or you were married to this person. Like you saw yourself like moving in, buying a house with this person. You had romantic feelings for this person. Um, because it's like, for whatever reason, this person hooked up with someone to retaliate against you and then they end up really regretting it. And, but it's like now this person that they hooked up with is retaliating against them because they're upset that they realize that they were only just sleeping with them because of you. It's a whole mess here because they see them chasing after you or that they, even that they're not chasing after you. It's like this person is a mess because they can't pull themselves together because they can't stop thinking about you. And it's a mess. Like their energy is a freaking mess. I'm like pulling out of it. I'm pulling out of it. Yes, crossroads. They're trying to decide what to do. I, they're the type of person I doubt they will even make up their freaking mind what to do. And the best choice for you to do is continue to elevate because they're a freaking mess. If they were to come back, it's like the version you would get them in. Ain't there's nothing like you envision this person to be. It's like you met this how you met this person. Yeah, you're, you're expecting more out of this person than what they truly are. You're expecting way more than what they truly are. It's like, I'm getting this person returns and they're nothing what you were expecting them to be. They will only drain your energy or end up being a big, yeah. They're nothing, it's like, look, this person is nothing what you thought they would be when they return. They're nothing what you thought they would be. But a big disappointment. You'll only realize why they were kept from you. It's like, you're gonna be looking like, this is not what I thought. They're not mature. It, they're not what you thought. They were not what you were making them out to be. It's, it's like they were painting themselves out to be like more wealthier than what they are. They are not what you are like fantasizing or expecting them to be. But you know what? Someone else is. There's someone that you were overlooking 
and you thought there was someone that you overlooked here, the person that you would end up with is going to be someone that you were saying, no, we're just friends. We're just friends. It's like, it's going to be someone that you overlook and you're going to realize that that's the path for you to take. You're going to realize that is the right one for you. And you're going to be like, oh my God, it's going to, it was right in front of you all this time. They were right in front of your face all this time, but you were distracted. This is the thing. And I'm, I'm like praying. This is the thing because it's like, you are so distracted, like, by this person that was not even who you were expecting them to be. You were expecting someone here to return. And when they finally return, you're going to realize, oh my gosh, what, what was I thinking? Like, this, this is not worth it. And then it's like... You're going to be realizing, like, because it's like there's someone here right in front of your face. And when you finally realize that this is your person, it's like you almost let this person get away. Because it's like the light is going to be like, oh. But you are waiting, it's like you're waiting for someone to come back. Only to realize that they're not the right person. And you are saying though, it's like you keep saying, it's like you keep trying to convince yourself that someone that you know is the right person for you is not the right person for you only to realize that and you're it's like when you when it finally hits you it's gonna overwhelm the hell out of you this will be someone that you already know They're not in a, re they won't be in a relationship. So you won't have to steal this person away from anyone. And this person. It's gone up. You know what? It's gonna be like unexpected. Because it's like. You told yourself so many times that they're not the one. That's like when it hits you. And it's going to be a major blessing. Because this person is going to give to you in a major way. Like in every aspect of your life love, finances, any, every way. They're going to be a major blessing. So it's like someone that you're going to start off like with a friend here. And people are gonna realize that there's a strong chemistry between you and this person. And you'll be like, yeah, but we're just friends, you know? That's how you'll be, we're just friends. You'll, you'll brush off the relationship between you and this person. And then you'll be like, oh my God. Then you're gonna, it's gonna be like, 
you'll really realize that you and this person are way more than friends. You know what, Aries, you're gonna have a decision to make between lust or love. It's gonna be a strong decision to make. Yeah. And it's gonna be a test. I don't even, it's like you won't even see this coming and you wouldn't even think. Here's the thing, it's like you wouldn't even think that when it's like when you get tested, when this when this moment comes, it's like you wouldn't even think that you will be tempted. But boy oh boy, boy oh boy, Aries, are you going to be tempted? I'm not sure exactly what is going to be, but the moment is going to, the moment of truth is going to come. And you the universe is going to see have you truly learned some sort of lesson here? Will you because if you have learned some major lesson here, you will either step into true love or you will go back into repeating some sort of cycle of lust again. And you may tell yourself, no, nah, it wouldn't be me, but new level, new devil. That's all I got to say. Because temptation is strong when it comes. And whatever this is, it ain't going to be that ex that you don't give a damn about. It may be someone that you gonna be like, oh, is this it? And you may be like, okay, I'm gonna pass it. And then they give you that smile and they all in this like, okay, you, but okay, just make sure you resist that temptation, okay, Aries? Now, you have someone from the past. This person wants to Do right by you. They want to do right by you. So, first of all, they want to communicate with you. The thing is, I don't see this as something that will last between you and this person from the past, but at least... They want to make things right between you and them. 
And the reason why I don't see things lasting between you and this person is because you're not interested in this person anymore. I feel like this person just don't spark your fire anymore. And I think because they rejected your love in the past and they waited so long to make things right, they just don't make you happy anymore. I think you just found your happiness during this time of being on your own. And on top of that, you have someone that like saw or you will meet someone that see your true potential that possibly you meet at work or you have met at work that sees your true potential in the meantime. And this is someone that you and this person will end up like purchasing a home together, like making some major financial decisions together. This is someone that you're going to end up in a long-term commitment with. This is someone that you can depend on, that's little committed, honest, and fair. very grounded, trustworthy, not the most adventurous person, but you love them. You love them very much. So, main thing here is just make sure you get through this sort of whatever this temptation is that's coming up here because something here that's wanting to there's someone here i'm getting this someone that is you'll know when it comes for whoever this is for there's someone that's divinely being sent your way and there's someone that's straight from the gates of hell being sent your way and they look very nice and sound very nice and but there's someone straight from the gates of heaven someone straight from the gates of hell and you'll know okay that's it aries resist the temptation turn from it that's it now with that being said because you guys and you have the sun card the devil and the lovers Make the right choice. It's going to lead to your happiness. With that being said, you all take care. Hit that like button, subscribe, leave a comment. Thank you.